Hello everyone. Today I am going to prove to you that one is equal to two using a simple algebraic uh, equation. So um, we'll start the equation by stating that a is equal to b. So um, now this equation is completely like um, hypothetical. So a is equal to b. So if a is equal to b, then uh, we can surely say that a into a is equal to b into a. We are simply multiplying both the sides by a. So moving on, here we can say that a into a is actually a square, like this, and a square is equal to b. So uh, we have uh, seen that a square is equal to b a, uh, and so now. We will subtract b square from both these sides. So um, we'll first do this: a square minus b square is equal to b a minus b square. Okay, fine. This is uh, completely fair up until now. Now we'll use some rules. So a square minus b square, as we know, is equal to a plus b into a minus b. So we'll just do that. A plus b into a minus b, uh, because a square minus b square is equal to a plus b a minus b. Multiply it by yourself. You can see it. So um, now in this uh, in the RHS that is the right hand side, here we'll take b as common. Okay. Yeah. Here we'll take b as common. So uh, b square is basically b into b. So if we take both the b's common like this, then what we are left is is b into a minus b, like this. B into a minus b. So now uh, it will be fair to cancel both of these, right? Cancel a minus b from the LHS and the RHS. So we are left with, get this, a plus b is equal to, yes, a plus b is equal to b. How is this possible? Which means that one plus one is equal to one. Which means two is equal to one. No, we have actually proved that one is equal to two. Whoa! Okay, have we actually proved it? Let's see it. Okay, so let's go through the equation one by one. So first, we'll see a is equal to b. Uh, yeah, there's nothing much to say here. So yeah, let's just move. So a into a is equal to b into a. Now here we can see that b is equal to a, right? Like yeah, a b is equal to a. So this means that b into a is actually equal to a into a. Yes. So a into a is equal to a into a. Makes complete sense, right? Right. Um. So now uh, let us move on. So uh, here we can see a into a is equal to a square. So a into a is equal to a square. Completely fine. Now b into a is equal to b a, right? Yes. So um, b into a is a into a. So b into a is basically a square, right? Yes, it's that's correct. So yeah, a square is equal to a square. That's basically our form, uh, our equation here. So now we are subtracting b square from both the sides. So here, a square minus b square is equal to b a minus b square. So we are basically doing the same thing on both the sides. A square minus b square is equal to a square minus b square. B a is equal to a square. Yes. So that's completely fine. But here comes the main loophole. A plus b into a minus b is equal to b into a minus b. No, there is nothing wrong with the formula. It's absolutely correct, but we need to bring more practicality here. 
a minus b is basically b minus b right so that's like basically zero that's uh, b minus b is basically zero so a into zero is equal to b into zero yes so that's completely correct anything into zero is equal to zero so it was wrong on our end to cancel these two these two things if we actually do it by the conventional method of all, uh, of solving linear uh, of solving equations that is by transposing uh, this uh, to the other side that is the rhs transposing zero to the from the lhs to the rhs what would, what we would have got would have been completely different we would have gotten b divided by zero now a, we know that anything divided by zero is actually meaningless like you cannot divide six p's as into zero people yeah so right so b in b upon zero is meaningless if we had done this by transposing then we would have got meaningless answers which would have been wrong so here we can prove that one is not equal to two we have disproved our proof theory okay, so that's quite bad but anyway if you like this video and would want to see more such videos then please consider subscribing to my channel and hit that notification bell so that you never miss such videos from me. Also do not forget to hit the like button under this video, share it to whoever might like it. Thank you for watching.